24th captain in their history. He's looking for his first goal of the year. Goal is in 16 games if you date back to last season. He starts this game up front between Kasperi Kapanen and Pavel Buchnevich. And now Quinn Hughes able to slide the puck ahead to Niels Hoagland. Nice lead pass. Here's Lafferty breaking in. Sam Lafferty to the net. Hit the post. Got past the goaltender, Bennington. Nice little saucer pass. And he is gone. Who outweights Bennington, but boy, just near side post through the blue paint. Tries to play the puck in. Canucks intercept. Here's a lead pass to Giuseppe. Besser takes his feet, he shoots it! Missed the net, Bennington might have got a little piece of it. Get her for the Vancouver Canucks, it's Brock Besser. Okay, and that shot just ticks. Feeds one back, Canucks changing while controlling. Blues have some tired bodies up there. Pedersen fakes the shot, Heronic as well. Feeds down, Quinn Hughes, wrist shot blocked. Pareko got in front of it, tried to clear it, but Hughes keeps the puck in. Now the Canucks have five fresh skaters out there as Hoaglander tried to bank that one, and I think then it went off his skate and off the side of the goal. Puck sent around. Heronic over to keep it in. Here's Heronic to Hughes. All the Blues over a minute and a half as Hughes scores! You just felt like eventually the dam was going to break. And Quinn Hughes scores the opening goal at 7.59 to make it 1-0 Vancouver. To play alive in the offensive zone, you know you've got some tired forwards against, and the Canucks do just that move the puck around, pull the Blues in their defensive position, and just a real smart shot from Quinn Hughes, low glove. This eludes the glove side of Bennington off the post and in. Hughes is second of the season, finally got the setup they wanted in a great shot for Kuzmenko. Here he is again, fakes the shot, puts it in front, Besser blocked. Bennington diving back. I don't know if he got in front of it or the defenseman in front of it. This is when it was put out front. There's the right skate of Kapanen helping out his goaltender. In reference when the Canucks were in Philadelphia, they could have played for three days and maybe not generated any goals. And so the Canucks see if they can't give themselves the lead here. Add to it. As an 18-year-old emergency call-up. For the Kings, right? Yes. I remember that, Nick. Here's Hughes backs right in. They get four goals in his last two games against St. Louis. The Blues, the only team he has more goals against than assists, and Quinn Hughes with his second of the night makes it 2 0. Face off win back to the point. Hughes, a shimmy, a shake, and looking for bodies in front. And it goes off the skate of Kevin Hayes as Bennington was leaving the post area on his glove side, thinking someone's going to convert this. And there's the inside left heel. 2 nothing Canucks. Thomas sends the puck around. Kuzmenko's on now. Gets it to Friedman coming off the right point. In front, tip on goal. And McCann on the rebound. Put it just wide. Oh, what a wonderful stop by Bennington getting his right leg up in the air. Came with the original tip and then just couldn't get the second chance to go. Pareko clears the puck out and Tyler Myers banks it the other way. McKayev didn't get much on it as he tried to backhand it in. And here's Letty passing across to Colton Pareko. Saad takes a lead pass. And converging on him were Susie and Myers to break it up. Now Tyler Myers up the middle. DJ Seppi's in on goal. Smithers. in a minute 10 and the Canucks are up by three darts right between the defensemen it's an excellent pass keeps skating goes to his forehand and Bennington you see that he thought he had that angle covered and it gets slipped past him Myers with the up ice pass this is a great camera angle they try to set up in the Vancouver zone Tory Cruz gave it away to Pedersen. We pass. Miller's alone. Short-handed. T.T. Miller scores. He had five shots.
shorthanded goals last year. Now he's got the first of the season for the Canucks, and they lead four to nothing. Pedersen is able to come up with the puck right there. It's right on his table. Saucer pass. Miller holds for long enough to get Binnington down, and then the backhand finish. Group just puts it right on the tape of Pedersen. And the Canucks pile up the goals. Buchnevich, penalty's over, Hughes is out of the box, but the Blues still have the puck, and that one hit the crossbar. Buchnevich rang it off the bar and out of play. Picked off by Thomas. Kairou. Leaves for Robert Thomas. Feeds one diagonally back, Pareko over the shot, hit a skate, Thomas on the rebound, and Demko stayed with that pinball and puck to slide to his right to make the save. Joshua going to stick on that pass, couldn't clear it out. 45 seconds on the power play. Shen brings it in front. Got it on the forehand. And Demko stayed right with it. Good pass. And the spin move. Demko finding the rebound. And the Canucks will try to take this one home. You wonder how much ice time the likes of Miller, Besser, Ederson, and certainly Quinn Hughes might see in the third period here with that Rangers game Lula. They want to make sure they get this one through to the finish line, of course, but want to be a little bit fresh for the game 24 hours from now. And Taco was talking this morning about looking to get more ice time to some of his players who deserve it. Just couldn't throughout that road trip. Connor Garland's name came up. Chance early and Demko maybe his best save thus far. As this is bumped to him, he finishes his curl and Trying to go on the blocker side. Demko, though, just making it look commonplace with his saves. He's had a couple of those and just missed the mark. Yeah, still looking for his first point. Now here's Garland with a step. Connor Garland put it wide. Another chance on a turnover. Lafferty tried to put it on the backhand. Hughes gets the puck, but he bobbled it. Corona has to hustle back to get there ahead of Shan, who gets behind him. Braden Shan. Demko with the right pad! Strips the puck off Hronik, tries to outweigh Demko, and uh, Demko... The cave after the puck, Blues find it first, Thomas. Now Butchnevich to Bortuzzo, back to Pavel Butchnevich, who shoots Demko with the left pad, flashing out to make the save, and here's Pedersen the other one. Checked, but following on is Kuzmenko. To Pedersen, to McKayev, scores! <laughs> Makes it five nothing. They get to this puck first, and then Kuzmenko makes a nice pass back to Pedersen, moves it up to Nakia, and five hole for five nothing. I've said before, if they handed out third assists at the end, Pavel Butchnevich almost gave it away, but it got past Hughes. Here's Thomas in on the right wing. Robert Thomas to fall. Demko sliding across, made another save. He's tracking the putt so well tonight. Back checking Hughes. And Demko, there are no holes there. And he's content just to pick the putter in. Garland gets it on the far side. And that's going to do it. Another convincing home ice victory for the Vancouver Canucks. Thatcher Demko with his fourth career shutout.